Welcome back to the channel, all you hardworking men and women. It's time to clock in. Hope you're having an amazing day, and I hope you are crushing it. And I got the ticker for you right here on the screen. I'm not going to hold you hostage, guys. If you want to take a look at this one, here it is. This is the one that I think you should have on your watch list going into tomorrow morning. That's going to be ticker symbol GWAV right here. Name of the company is Green Wave Technology Solutions. Currently sitting at $1.85. So that is the ticker. So if you came here for the ticker, not going to hold you hostage. But I'm going to go over a couple reasons why I wanted to bring it to your attention in this video and if you guys are new to the channel you don't know who i am my name is andrew make sure you read the disclaimer day trading is very risky and most traders lose money and any of my results or any results discussed in this video are not typical 2021 had a great year my first year of trading made over 77k 300 percent return crypto i've done something very similar 4k to 36k in one trade 790 percent return now i run team alpha trading hoping that i can teach other hardworking men just like myself the exact same strategies i've used to be pretty successful in the market so if you're a hardworking man or a woman, you have a stable job, you make at least 45K, you're not homeless, and you got a little bit of money to invest in your own education, highly recommend that you join our 30-day trading challenge. I guarantee you, if you take our challenge, you will be a more confident trader in the next 30 days. So click the link down there to learn and get more information. And let's dive into the meat of today's video. So when you're looking for swing trade opportunities here, you really have to take a look at the catalyst. You have to take a look at the news and the press releases and see exactly what the company has going on. And not only that, with some experience, you start to learn how some of these stocks can possibly move after certain things happen. So the, uh, the real reason why I really wanted to bring this one to your attention is number one, because it's a super low float. Now, what does that mean? Uh, low float just means that the amount of shares out on the market is a very small number compared to other companies out on the market. So as a general rule, typically if a stock has a less than 10 million shares on the flow available to trade, it's a pretty low float stock. Now what that means is since there's such a small amount of shares out on the market, I know 3.5 million shares sounds like a lot, but compared to other companies, it's definitely not. There's plenty of stocks and companies that have billions of shares out on the market. So 3.5 million shares is very low. And since there's just a small amount of shares out on the market, these stocks typically do see more volatility. What that means is these stocks go up and down pretty damn quick. And traders look to take advantage of this volatility and get in and then get out when these things, you know, move to the upside or if they move to the downside, right? Um, so with that being said, Another catalyst, another news, another press release that you need to be looking out for here in penny stock world, penny stock land, is the reverse stock split, okay? So typically what happens is a company needs to stay on the NASDAQ. So what the NASDAQ is, is it's a, it's a big exchange. And all of these smaller companies, they want to be on the NASDAQ because they have access to way more investors, right? So you have access to institutional investors, more traders, more people are able to buy and sell your stock, which is overall good for a company if they ever need to raise money in the future. They won't access to all of those investors. Now, if a company loses their NASDAQ compliance, they have to move down to the OTC market, which is the over-the-counter market where you don't have access to all of the big institutional investors. You don't really have access to many hedge funds. And a lot of retail traders just do not trade OTC over-the-counter stocks because they're deemed as way riskier than anything that's on the NASDAQ or the New York Stock Exchange. So many of these companies, once they get on the NASDAQ, I mean, they're going to do whatever it takes to stay on the NASDAQ. And one of the compliance points for the NASDAQ is that your stock price must be above $1, right? So to make their stock price above a dollar because they were below a dollar, they just actually did a reverse stock split to regain NASDAQ compliance. And what that means is they take the amount of shares out on the market, they cut those shares down by a lot, and what that does is it increases the price, but it keeps the value of the company the same. Now, I know that may sound like Chinese or that may sound like it's very confusing, but we explain everything inside of Team Alpha Trading, inside of our community. Um, and really what you need to know about this is typically after a reverse stock split, you see a bit more of downward pressure on the stock. Typically, it starts to bottom out. And then typically, this puts the company in a better position and they start to release some better news. And we've seen many stocks that, uh, have started releasing really good news after a reverse stock split, and then they go on these big runs, right? Um, so this one's got a low float. They recently did a reverse stock split, and this one is really close to being near a bottom here. I mean, it's down 92% for the month. At least that's what it says on Google. That's probably a bit off because of the overall 
um, the reverse stock split. So I don't know if that's completely accurate, but if you take a look at it, I mean, even when you pull it up on Weeble, this one's at a very, very, very low price. And I could definitely see this one starting to get a rounded bottom here and starting to move its way back up. But again, make sure you do your own research. Just want to bring this one to your attention, guys. Uh, if all of that made sense, comment down below and let me know. And I will see you guys in the next video. Deuces.